This is Lance Shepard, Pioneer Field Agronomist in Northeast Indiana, coming to you from Kosciuszko County, just northwest of Warsaw. Every spring there are discussions on when do we start planting and when should we stop planting before a cold rain. Today I would like to take time to showcase the effects of chilling ambition or chilling injury from seed being planted into a cool moist seed bed or planting followed by a cold rain. In this case, this field was planted on April 28th, around 9 a.m. to be exact. The low temperature for that day was in the low 30s, and the soil temp wasn't much different. Unfortunately for the seed, it was planted into a moist seed bed and was able to imbibe water shortly after planting. This is a concern because the seed imbibes the majority of its water within the first 30 minutes after being exposed to saturated conditions. This particular field was planted at 35,000 seeds per acre. As you can see, I have one one thousandth of an acre flagged off. Currently, there are 18 plants that have emerged and are at the V2 growth stage, while the remaining 16 seeds that are marked with orange stakes had chilling ambition injury. Surprisingly, out of the 45% of seeds that received chilling injury, seven of those plants have started to emerge after being severely affected. After pulling out of this field, the customer planted another field nearby later that afternoon as temperatures reached near 50 degrees, and that field was not affected by chilling ambition. This demonstrating the value of planting when soil temps are above 50 degrees and stopping at least one day in advance of a cold spell. That concludes this Pioneer Growing Point Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.